Giant Empire just came out with a new update, so nine new Luxon Zoddy cars and bug fixes. So we're going to go ahead and check them out, and we get our stuff removed. So, uh, um, so this is an off brand, uh, Audi R8. So, yeah, that rating was Audi in the game. It's off brand. So, yeah, let's go ahead and just check them out. Uh, I don't know why this font is like that. Like some of the fonts changed. On the cards, I guess it's only for the licensed cars. So like only licensed cars have like this new font change, which I find very, very weird. But whatever, it's what they wanted to do, I guess. So new vehicles, and here we go. So um, yeah, it's a 2024 Audi A6 limousine. Okay, interesting. It's a 58,000, not too expensive. Hot, uh, top speed's 150 miles an hour. Um, handling's 49 percent, and braking is 40 percent. Go ahead, and explode it. Fully detailed engine. Um. And fully detailed interior, back seats, whatever, trunk, very detailed, looks good. Then we got the 2023 Audi RS 3 limousine, and uh, I guess go ahead and explode it. De uh, fully detailed engine, fully detailed interior, and uh, yeah, um, trunk. 70,000, uh, not expensive at all, 150 miles an hour. Pretty much, I think it looks like the same stats as the last car, so. Uh, 2022 Audi RS Q8, um, 155 miles an hour, 45% handling, and 48% braking, 98k. Then we got the Audi RS6 Avant, 174 miles per hour, handling 50%, braking 32%, 122k. Uh, explode, fully detailed engine, fully detailed interior, and fully de not fully detailed trunk, but a trunk. And here we go with, uh, part of our whatever um 1996 audi avant rs2 uh, 160 miles an hour handling is 44 percent braking is 53 is 35 percent worth 150k we had to get the car pack which is uh 100 robux um seems like i have the new somewhat new um thing here the new ui so that's cool glad to have that at least for now um so yeah it's 800 robux way too overpriced in my opinion um, here we got the, uh, Audi TT RS Coupe. Um, I guess, I don't know what the last audio was supposed to be. I guess the off-brand Radian was supposed to be a TT, um, which I find very weird, but works, I guess. Uh, I guess we can go ahead and explode it on fully detailed interior. Well, uh, engine looks really good. Uh, detailed interior and then small little trunk. 205 miles an hour, handling is 45%, braking is 41%. 160k. I already own it. I forgot to explode this. I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, engine interior is not that detailed at all. Um, and trunk. The, the the interior in real life, I don't think is that detailed anyway. So not blaming driving power products. Into Audi R8 Spider. Uh, explode. Trunk interior. Engine looks nice. Then we got a roof, so we can uh open it. I'm um, pretty sure it's animated. Um. Yeah, as you guys can see, it's animated, so well, I'll, just, I'll just let this play. Takes a very long time, but still pretty sick, I guess. And then, of course, the windows go up, which is pretty cool. 197 miles per hour, handling is 51%, bringing is 42%, and 196k, not that bad. And then we got the Audi R8 GT Coupe, which is part of the Robux pack, but it's worth 450k. Probably definitely one of my favorite Audi R8s. I don't even like the Audi R8 that much. Like, I like it, but I don't really care for it. So, yeah, it's a nice looking Audi, I guess. Top speed is 197, handling is 51%, and braking is 44%. And let's go ahead and explode it. Frank, interior, looks really nice. And, um, engine looks extremely detailed, so. And then here's probably the most interesting one. Um, out of the, uh, out of all of them, uh, probably the most insane car we've ever had in Driving Pyre. So, 2012 Audi R, um, R18 Ultra. Uh, this is 15.5 million. Um, yeah, like I said, probably the most insane car we've ever had in Driving Pyre. Um, yeah, it's a LM, um, LMP, or whatever it is, uh, Group 1 car. But yeah, probably the most insane one is 15.5 million, so not cheap at all. Go ahead and explode it. Um, I'm only these like little doors open up, but interior looks really, really uh, nice, I suppose. 211 miles an hour, uh, handling is 87%, braking is 50%, so obviously this is a track vehicle, because I mean, no crap. Unfortunately, I can't test the new cars, 
um like the pack cards because obviously i'm not spending 800 robux on it yeah you guys can see this right here we can pro um, purchase the audio pack right there and we can uh go into inside the dealership it's got this like a little audi stand thing right there so i guess go ahead and type in audi and see the cars like in person so here's the first one um it's this one of these limousine ones the uh, a6 limousine yeah i mean it's an audi looks really good license i like it interior um, of course everything goes i'm um, not too sure why that thing says park when we are clearly driving but okay and here we have the rs3 limousine um yeah i mean pretty good i guess it's cool it's not the fastest thing in the world obviously i mean it's just a little oddy so yeah it's, it's cool um then we probably got one of my favorite cars um out of the ones i bought today yeah one of my favorite ones i feel like the tt's uh the tt is underrated um, I really like this thing a lot. So yeah, probably definitely my favorite. Um, one of my favorites out of the ones I bought. So, yeah, definitely very sick. Interior also looks pretty, pretty good. I mean, kind of this looks like a standard Audi. Um, but it, it's still nice. Then we have the RS Q8, if it decides to load, of course. Yeah, nice little SV. Um, SUV looks really nice. I like it. It's cool. Yeah, I mean, it's far from the most exciting, but it's not bad. And here we have the RS6 Avant. Um yeah here, here we are not too sure why the stock color is purple but it's whatever but yeah i mean it looks cool i mean i like it the interiors all the the interiors look really really similar which is kind of weird but whatever and then we have the r8 spider but yeah i'm going to put the roof down just because i prefer the roof down like i don't, I don't know if, if i'm different with anyone else but like i think i'm one of the only people who actually prefers the roof down then up but i mean it's whatever i mean he's like going for his person and look at the roof he put down or whatever uh detail is pretty insane of course i mean it's a licensed car but yeah i mean not bad it's an r8 i mean you can't really hate on an r8 and of course the most craziest car um we have is uh this crazy thing probably my favorite car out of the ones i bought today um i suppose i could max it if i wanted to and then i could like put on a race or something See how good it is. I guess I can go ahead and do that. So I'll go ahead and max this thing. And I'll see you guys whenever I finally have it maxed. Alright, it's max. So uh, I'll go ahead and teleport to the um circuit race, I guess. I guess that's kind of the race that people would mainly want to see. So yeah, I'll go ahead and go on here. And I'll just do a uh, solo race. And we'll see how it does. But yeah, I'll speed this up. And I'll see you guys whenever I'm done. Something I'm kind of realizing is that they did change the font for like the second place or like the position um or whatever. They changed the uh I think it's actually with like the whole UI. They changed like the font, which I kind of don't really like that. I kind of prefer the other one, the uh, old one more. I just have a moderator join me. I didn't know that Hollow was a moderator. I don't even remember being friends with Hollow, to be honest. I don't even know who Hollow is. It was probably like one of my friend's friends or something. I don't really know. Okay, I'm absolutely failing at this race, so, uh, whatever my time is, honestly, just freaking like, I don't even know. It's, like, freaking subtracted by, like, a whole 60 seconds, I guess. And that's probably the time you would be able to get. I don't know why I said it like that, but whatever. I'm not the best racer, so, um, as everyone freaking knows by now, uh, I'm not gonna get anything crazy. So, I got 313, but you can probably get, like, I don't freaking know, like, 3... 30 or something but yeah i'm not gonna freaking do the whole thing again i'm i don't even know to be fair i don't even want to record today so i guess that's pretty much it okay quickly before i end this video uh i got one of my um fans to buy the car pack and well they already bought themselves but they bought the car pack and 
they're letting me use it so but this is the uh old r6 i guess or whatever i don't freaking know what audio this is looks bland like i said but pretty sure that's just how it is in real life so I'm not gonna compl I'm, I'm not gonna complain it's cool though i mean yeah it's nice and this is the uh r8 the other one the r10 gt or whatever it is yeah definitely probably my uh favorite one out of the license cards that we got today either that or the uh group one car or lmph whatever it's called but yeah fully detailed looks nice i like it and it's pretty much the expected top speed 198 yeah i mean it's cool i mean audio licensing well i mean nothing to really say comment down below what you guys want to freaking comment i guess comment down below what you guys think about this update and yeah have a good day everyone and peace